Hello. Well, my name is Charlie Penrod, and this is my contest entry into the 2002 Quaker State Profiles of Personal Courage short film contest. This is my story on how I overcame adversity and personal struggles to be the best possible person I can be. Let me start off by telling you a little bit about myself. Computer programming is my passion. A lot of my friends will tell you that I think in zeros and ones, but they're just kidding. I've worked as a software engineer for five years and love it. I get so excited when I walk in the door at work, I, I feel like a kid at a candy store. However, I've been dealt a difficult hand that hinders my ability to do the best possible job I can do. You see, I have narcolepsy. At any given moment, completely out of my control, I can fall dead asleep. It had gotten worse over the years and was really starting to affect my work. I can't tell you how many times I've been working and bam, next thing I know, my face is on a keyboard and drool is running down the side of my cheek. My coworkers tried to wake me up, but couldn't. My narcolepsy had gotten bad enough that I would automatically enter REM4 sleep. A simple nudge on the shoulder or tap on the cheek simply wasn't enough. I looked into several options. Drugs, therapy, herbal medication, but nothing seemed to work. I had a problem. A problem that needed a solution fast. That solution is Mike. Hey, Dom. Mike is my insurance policy that narcolepsy won't stop me from achieving my goals and making my dreams a reality. Whenever I have an episode, as we now refer to it, Mike is there to, to wake me up. Wherever I go, Mike goes. When I first started working for Charlie, I was coming out of a difficult time in my life. I had just been kicked out of the Nevada Amateur Weightlifting Circuit for my third positive test on steroids. I don't deny I did them, and I don't deny I might have developed a bit of a temper while I was on. Anyhow, that might have been what dipped him out and I was back on the juice. Charlie? What? Char When I first met Charlie and started to work with him, I found that his narcolepsy was pretty bad. <laughs> REM4 sleep, as they call it, isn't an easy stage of sleep to bring someone out of. I've had to resort to some uh, pretty creative <laughs> and cool techniques to wake him up. Some people ask me, is it worth all the cuts and bruises just to stay awake? To them I say, you bet it is. If you're going to overcome personal struggles and adversity, you've got to make some sacrifices. My name is Charlie Penrod and this has been my profile of pers-